Stability AI has just raised about $100 million that values the company that's behind Stable Diffusion at $1 billion, with a B, $1 billion. Let's dive in. Okay, so here you can see in this particular article, which is dated September 7th, one of the team members at Forbes picked up on a story where Stability AI was looking to raise funds from a couple of different venture capital companies, uh, Lightspeed Venture and Co2. I'm not sure if I said that right, but uh, basically, initially the thoughts were that it would be half a billion in valuation, and then that sort of proceeded to a billion in valuation. And ultimately, as you can see here, uh, that actually happened. So Stable Diffusion, and this article was dated October 11th, 2022, uh, Stability, Stable Diffusion maker Stability AI raised funding to $1 billion in valuation. So they basically raised as much as $100 million in capital, and this amount of funding would value Stability AI at about a $1 billion. Uh, this is pretty exciting for this particular space. If you go on to read about this article and sort of some of the outputs from this news, one of the big things that you'll see is that essentially their business model is going to be similar to other large open source companies like IBM's Red Hat or MongoDB, where they offer free versions for general consumption and then a premium paid product for larger customers. Now, I think this is really, really interesting because if you sort of look at this as a way to monetize within the space, this is probably going to be a very common theme that you'll see over and over within the AI space, in particular, as companies look to augment within a sort of corporate environment and make it possible to do the job more efficiently, in this case with text to image generation and the natural progression being text to video implementation. Well, this is absolutely going to be a game changer for a lot of roles within the space. Now, as you'll see me talk about in a lot of the other videos that I cover, I personally believe that artificial intelligence, where AI actually does the full work of someone, I think that is quite a ways off for most of the applications. In particular, augmented intelligence is probably the most realistic scenario. And obviously, we're seeing that here with Diffusion. And you can see sort of the explanation of what diffusion is. It's basically a, if you're not familiar, generative technique, um, which allows the AI model to destroy an image by introducing noise and then reconstructing it so that it can learn techniques for how to build the images. And essentially this leads to, without going into a ton of detail, being able to just provide some basic text that then is used with a simpler model take the text and put it into a simple image. And then the AI that has been trained using diffusion can take that and amplify it by denoising it essentially. And this is really powerful. Uh, you can see, obviously, there are a lot of other companies like Google and OpenAI that are competing in this space. And they're generally providing these platforms in a similar model or even further on the spectrum toward just being fully open source. So it's gonna be really interesting seeing how a company like Stability AI is able to function in this space. Uh, one of the really interesting data points, and this isn't confirmed, but uh, one of the folks actually who's sort of in the know or you know potentially has information uh, stated that the just the cloud bill for Stability AI was $50 million. Now, whether or not that's true, I don't know, uh, but that would be a massive amount um, of spend that they had to do in order to support their operations. And if they only raised $100 million, well, you can see how this is going to be sort of a challenge to be able to execute on at any type of scale unless they start monetizing things quickly. Uh, but it's definitely been a massive hit. Uh, Stability AI and Stable Diffusion in general um, has been a massive hit. And I think that you'll continue to see a lot of really interesting things to come uh, from Stability AI. Um, in particular, you can see a lot of the projects here uh, where some of these are available to interact with and use right away. And then some of them are coming soon. 
So I encourage you to stay tuned to this channel. Let me know if you have any specific areas you'd like me to dive into with regards to stability AI, and I'll be happy to dig into those. Just post a comment below. Uh, with that said, thanks for watching. Feel free to subscribe, and we'll look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye for now.